Newcastle United ask fans to stop wearing traditional Arabic clothing to games. Newcastle United have asked fans to stop wearing traditional Arabic clothing to matches. Following the £305 million Saudi back takeover earlier this month, Newcastle supporters wore tea towels and head coverings for their Premier League match against Tottenham at St James Park on Sunday. But Newcastle have now told fans that continuing to wear Arabic clothing and Middle East-inspired head coverings is culturally inappropriate and risks causing offence to others. Newcastle United is kindly asking supporters to refrain from wearing traditional Arabic clothing or Middle East-inspired head coverings at matches if they would not ordinarily wear such attire, read a statement from Newcastle. A number of supporters have recently attended St James Park wearing associated head coverings and robes, marking the takeover of the club by the Public Investment Fund, PIF, PCP Capital Partners and RB Sports and Media. No one among the new ownership group was in any way offended by the attire of the fans who chose to celebrate in this way. It was a gesture that was acknowledged as positive and welcoming in its intent. However, there remains the possibility that dressing this way is culturally inappropriate and risks causing offence to others. All visitors to the club are, as always, encouraged to wear whatever is the norm for their own culture or religion, continuing to reflect the broad and rich multicultural communities and groups from which the club proudly draws its support. Simeon explains why he snubbed handshake with Klopp after Atleti's defeat to Liverpool Mohamed Salah makes history and Liverpool's victory over Atletico Madrid Jurgen Klopp reacts to Diego Simeon's decision to snub full-time handshake earlier on Wednesday, Newcastle also announced the departure of Steve Bruce as manager by mutual consent. Following his exit, Bruce said, I am grateful to everyone connected with Newcastle United for the opportunity to manage this unique football club. I would like to thank my coaching team, the players and the support staff in particular for all their hard work. There have been highs and lows, but they have given everything even in difficult moments and should be proud of their efforts. This is a club with incredible support and I hope the new owners can take it forward to where we all want it to be. I wish everyone the very best of luck for the rest of this season and beyond. For more stories like this, check our sport page.